Kurt Sabin here, uh, Category Manager for MX Goggles here at Oakley. I want to talk to you a little bit about lens care and goggle care to prolong the life of your goggle. In every goggle comes with a uh, warranty and instruction card. It's going to give you everything that we're going to discuss here to tell you about how to take care of your goggle. Please read it. So for MX goggles, uh, lenses come with anti-fog on a single lens. So prolonging and taking care of that goggle is gonna be very critical to the performance of that product over its lifetime. So now we're gonna talk to you about general care and cleaning of your goggle. Right here I have a goggle that has some roost and mud on it. And what we're gonna do to remove that is we're gonna take a water bottle and we're gonna gently pour off the water so that it takes the mud off and the debris and remove that off of the lens and the goggle. We wanna make sure that we get all of this off because as we wipe it with micro bag, we wanna make sure that we don't damage the lens. We wanna make sure we're not scratching any portion of an iridium or just a raw lens. So we make sure that we clear everything off this and we'll go ahead and gently tap the goggle and remove a lot of the debris and the moisture. Make sure we preserve the anti-fog properties and then we'll gently blot the backside of the lens first as that's the cleanest portion and then we'll blot the front of the lens to remove the mud and debris. So now we're gonna talk about general care and cleaning of the goggle frame after you're done riding and you've uh, cleaned off most of the major debris from roost. You're gonna go ahead and disassemble the frame and the lens. We're gonna grab the center beam of the frame and the nose area and pull apart and you'll dislodge the lens completely. Then what we'll do is we'll take the frame and put it into some soapy water, um, maybe a mild soap and water, no harsh chemicals, nothing that can uh, damage the goggle or compromise the integrity of the product. And then once you're finished with that, you'll go ahead and rinse with warm water thoroughly, remove all of that soap, and then we'll go ahead and air dry that goggle so that complete moisture is gone and you're ready for use again. All right, so now that you completely cleaned your goggle, we're gonna go ahead and prepare it for storage. We're gonna go ahead and store the goggle into the micro bag. And the tip of the day would be to have this strap outside of the micro bag. This way, it allows the straps and buckles not to contact the back of the anifog, damaging the back of the lens, prolonging the performance of your product. So now in the micro bag, we have two handy cases that you can store your goggles in uh, long term. One is a multi-case holding three goggles. The other is a single case. Definitely recommended not to store the goggle in your car overnight or uh, just on the dashboards where the sun and the heat can get to it. You definitely want to have these protected cases ready for next use. So for Airbrake MX, we have uh, one special feature uh, above and beyond the others. Um, same general care and cleaning of the lens and frame. But what you're gonna do is we have a full serviceable uh, faceplate that's on this goggle frame. So what we'll do is we'll take the lens out as you normally would for cleaning. And here where the attachment points are on the frame, you have about eight to 10 attachment points for this rigid frame to a rear frame. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna dislodge these little hooks and loops and remove this entire frame from this goggle and fully serviceable. This rear frame is also interchangeable to snow cross sand, and any other uh, configuration you may need for your usage. So for removing the faceplate on Airbrake MX, a quick pro tip is gonna be take a very small screwdriver and remove the loop system on the faceplate. That way it very, very easily pulls away from the frame. And that way you're not damaging any of the face foam or anything when you're pulling very abruptly to remove it from the frame. So here we fully disassembled the rear frame from the Airbrake. This one happens to be a, a mountain bike specific for ventilation. We also have H2O, uh, Snowcross, many different uh, ones. Fully serviceable, uh, wear and tear, anything that goes on with this, you can replace this part at any time. Thanks again, and that's it for tips and tricks on uh, MX goggles.